Hi, I'm Olivia Dean and I'm a singer-songwriter from East London. My earliest memories of singing, I think I started singing when I was like eight because I was really shy as a child and my mum sent me to like Saturday singing school and the first performance I did I sang um, Tomorrow from Annie but I had to have my back to the audience because I was too nervous. So I stood with my back to the audience like hiding behind the piano like crying like Tomorrow. Um, yeah, so that was my first performance. Amy Winehouse, hearing her music growing up, I was just so intrigued and fascinated by her as just a person and a personality and just, I loved her storytelling. Um, but then I also loved songwriters like Carole King um, and I loved Paul Simon too. I, when I heard Graceland, I was like blown away. Um, but yeah, I'd say they were like the top three that made me think, oh, I really want to do this as a job myself. My band, I mean the lovely thin, you can't see now, <laughs> are people that are like my age, that I met, I met Finn in college and um, Joel and Desh through, through Finn, I think. But just like I enjoy that we're all sort of a similar age and doing it all for the first time together and we're all excited about things at the same time, if that makes sense. And um, yeah, they're pretty cool. Last summer time-ish, I was in my flat in lockdown by myself and um, I was just frustrated because it was supposed to be my first year of playing festivals and I was like, how can I get myself in front of people? How can I bring music back to the community? And um, we had the idea of getting a truck, converting it into a, like a fully functioning venue with a generator and everything. And then off we went really, just around the whole UK, just turning up to know where people lived and being like, hey, beep, beep, can we play some music? <laughs> and it was really good. Honestly, I, I feel so grateful that I was able to do that, especially in a time when there was no music happening. I got my own little slice, so it was good. What does individuality mean to me? That was a hard question. I would say, um, I think I'm still figuring it out, like how to be authentic to myself and how to feel confident just sort of being an individual. But I think you know in your gut what feels right and like if you think something's cool and you want to wear something or, I don't know. I think being an individual is the coolest thing about a person, so I think you just go for it.